Dear children the topic for today's discussion is prepositions class 10th what is a preposition preposition means that which is placed before preposition is a word which is placed before a noun or a pronoun it shows the relationship between a noun or pronoun and other words in a sentence there are three types of prepositions such as single word preposition multi word preposition and participle preposition single word prepositions are about among beside during into on through and many more similarly multi word prepositions are according to due to along with except for in addition to in comparison with apart from in front of instead of in relation to and many more prepositions can be used at the end of sentences such as in case of wh questions what are you looking at in case of a relative clause this is the book i have been looking for in case of passives i do not speak until i am spoken to infinitives there was no chair to sit on and exclamation what a difficult situation he is in mark the prepositions at the end of these sentences now children what are the different types of prepositions based on their functions prepositions are of three types such as prepositions of place prepositions of time and other prepositions so let us discuss about prepositions of place let us have some pictures for idea we have point in space line surface area and volume these are symbols for different objects or things if the place is seen as a point then what are the uses of prepositions such as to at away from and from for example we went to the hotel we went to the door at we stayed at home we stayed at an inn away from we came away from the house we stayed away from home similarly if the place is seen as a line that is in terms of length what are the different uses of prepositions on to on of across and along the ball rolled on the goal line london is on the thames we turned off the main road zanzibar island is off the coast of africa i walked across the road we walked along the river bank now let us see the use of prepositions in the place it seen as a surface on to he fell on to the floor on there is a box on the table off he took the picture off the wall that is a place off the map he looked through the window he took a walk across the field here the place it seen as a surface 
now let us see the use of prepositions when the place is seen as an area or territory into the crowded into the streets in i have a house in the city here the place city it's seen as an area out of the flew out of the country we stayed out of the district we went for a walk through the park if the place it's seen as a volume or a rigid substance or body into you ran into the house here house is a 3d object or it is seen as a volume the food is in the cupboard he climbed out of the water he was out of the room and through the wind blew through the tree we can use preposition to show directions also such as up and down he walked up and down the room similarly across over and along he walked along across or over the streets dear children look at the picture for more clarification use of preposition in case of passages the man ran behind the van we drove by or passed the town hall we turned around the corner the earth moves around the sun positions the house stands between two trees the church is located among the trees here between and among the two prepositions have been used to show the position of the houses similarly prepositions such as under beneath or below above over behind in front of on the top of can be used to show the positions such as the river is below the van there are clouds above the van a man is standing by the van the road is underneath the van the road stretches in front of and behind the van the rack is on the top of the van similarly we can use prepositions to show motion also such as towards into along out of away from through the train sped towards into along out of away from through the tunnel over and above children over means both vertically above and higher than but above means higher than for example the aeroplane is flying over the head here over means vertically above similarly there is a temple above the house here above means at a higher level over means across from one side to the other to the other side or in every part of for example there is a bridge over the river here over means across he jumped over the brook here over means from one side to the other he is famous all over the world here over all over means in every part of uses of under below and beneath children under means directly below or lower than 
For example, the cat is sitting under the tree. Under means less than also. His income per month is under 5000 rupees. It shows the authority or power of some someone. About 50 mechanics work under him. Below means lower than. The sun sets below the horizon. You put your signature below the statement. Beneath means directly under something. To or in a lower position than something. There is a rat beneath the blanket. It also means lower in position and rank. Through, across and along. Through means entering at one side, on one surface and coming out at the other. The road goes through the forest. Across means from one side to the other. There is a bridge across the river. Along means in the direction of the length of and in a line from one end to the other. There are trees along the road. Before and in front of. Children, before means in front of. For example, the king is riding before his courtiers. You can see the king is at first. The girl is sitting in front of the man. What is the use of behind? There is a sweet case behind the man sitting in the chair. It shows just beside on the back of. Against. Against means next to or touching an upright surface. For example, there is a ladder against the wall. Similarly, the girl is leaning against the wall. Here, touching an upright surface. Opposite. It means facing each other. There is a church opposite my house. Similarly, Peter is standing opposite Gopal. Thank you.